High Court Judge Justice Tawanda Chitapi has reserved his judgment in a matter the Citizens' Coalition for Change is seeking to block Sangezo Chavangu, claiming to be the party's interim Secretary General from recalling its members. Ladies and gentlemen, this is now a CCC versus Chavangu matter. Initially, it was the CCC MPs versus Chavangu, and the lawyers thought it was wise to be launch a triple C versus Chavangu matter. Chavangu recalled 15 triple C MPs, 9 senators, and 17 councillors on October 4, claiming the head ceased to be party members. The expelled members appealed at the High Court before their case was dismissed after they failed to prove they still belonged to the opposition party. Triple C then filed an urgent court application seeking to stop Chamisa from representing the party and, and, and an interim interdict was granted last week when the matter was yes on Tuesday, which is yesterday, Triple C lawyer Obey Shawa admitted that the party should not be granted the internet as the constant recalls were unfair and caused irreplaceable harm. So according to Chawango, it was good for the party to get an interdict that would stop Chawango from recalling Triple C MPs further. But there was also an issue last week when Jacob Mdenda actually read out and recorded another set of MPs after this interdict had been given. So Bayeshawa said, after the ruling of the main matter, the first respondent issued some records of the applicant's member. He is not deterred by the pending matter. By the time the main matter is yet, there will be no more CCC appointed members in parliament or council. The first respondent has nothing to lose if he waits for the determination of the main matter. The presumption is that all elected officials were sponsored by the party during the August 2023 elections. There is no known record by the first respondent that those members should not participate under the applicant ticket. He only appeared on the scene when it was time to harvest. That shouldn't be allowed. He is enjoying the fruits of the labor of the applicant, said Shava. Chavang's lawyer, Louis Uriri, urged the court to dismiss the application because the party had failed to act on time and started legal proceedings after the recourse had been announced and confirmed. So this one is a very, very sad development in that Louis Uriri is actually saying the Triple C was reactionary in their doing. They had to wait for, for, for after the recourse to effect any uh, to, to, to challenge Chawangu's candidature. So what is happening is the court now has to determine from a CCC point of view whether Chawangu or not is from Triple C. Anokone Kainemfar, Dinwenyu, Honorable Matif.